Whether crypto advanced or unspeakably new, Bitcoin.com has a wallet for you. We do not permit alcoholic beverages, alcoholic containers in the city chambers. You need to dispose of these containers if you want to remain in the meeting. If you do not dispose of the containers, you will be asked to leave. Are you speaking to someone specifically? <clears throat> the public is not allowed to speak. I was making a call to talk radio a few months ago about this incident. Actually, it wasn't about this incident. I, I wasn't talking about this incident, but it was a call to Keen Talk Radio, and the host brought up this incident. I don't think brown bottles are illegal, gentlemen. Obviously, this is disruptive for the process. They disrupted, they disrupted uh, their own they process. Full authority over this process. This was uh, labeled the drinking game. And I guess around 2009, some free staters were arrested for drinking out of the wrong colored bottles at the wrong moments during the meeting. Now, it may be a little hard to imagine being perceived as the bad guy for just doing that, but somehow uh, the host managed to figure out a way to, to have a problem with this incident. I mean, not with the arrest, but with the fact that they were there in the meeting drinking out of brown bottles. Take that and record it. Yep. Stand up. Stand up. You're under arrest. Uh, You're a disgrace. You don't have to understand. This is a disgrace. Let go of the bottle. Okay, I'm on your back. Do not resist. So uh, the, the charge, I think, was officially, ugh, I don't remember what the charge was, but it had, uh, I mean, there was a suspicion that there was alcoholic beverage in the containers, if that makes sense. But I think uh, at least some of the people who were arrested, they, they, they weren't actually drinking beer or, or anything alcoholic, just water. Anyway, what I was calling talk radio about was to, just to mention the news that the Libertarian Party had achieved ballot status. If I recall, that's what, what I was calling about, you know, shortly after it happened. Uh, so this must have been a call in November of 2016, right after the election. And the caller was just like, whoa, the Libertarians, those are the people who, oh, they did this awful thing, you know, they, they, went, to the, they went to the city council meeting and drank out of the wrong colored bottles, and I'm just so ups, upset about that, you know, basically, was the, the way that he was uh, talking. And I, and I said something to him that I that I wish I would say more often and then I wish that more people would say more often I said okay uh, by their grievances shall ye know them if you're against you know, if, you're, if your grievance is that somebody went and did something harmless you're the bad guy well, having said that it is very hard to go to events like this with a group and have the entire group behave with the kind of demeanor that will win, you know, these talk show hosts and average people over. Ultimately, there was something vaguely annoying about these people in there, and everyone could pick up on that, not just the politicians. This is why I'm such a big fan of activism that you do alone, because then you have to do something to become hated. You don't have to have just one person in your group do something annoying. And if it's just you, your lines of communication are pretty short. I say, generally, do what you can by yourself, from where you are, or where you're going to be anyway. No, not all activism can be that kind. There's definitely a place for some activism that requires groups, but it comes with the downside. You can't decide who's going to show up, and you can't avoid the fact that the most annoying person in your group is going to be the one that your group is associated with. I do wish, you know, whether it's groups or individuals, I do wish there was more stuff like this going on at every city council and town board of aldermen in New Hampshire. Perfect or not, more activity tends to be good activity.
Why does the world look like this? Well, it's because you're using these instead of these. Admittedly, so am I sometimes. But if you're not using Bitcoin yet, you're missing the boom of the century. So go to Bitcoin.com, get their free wallet, find out what it's like to be in a free market. Whether crypto advanced or unspeakably new, Bitcoin.com has a wallet for you.